Hey budgeters and savers, Chris Budgets here with another video for you guys. If you guys are new to my channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to be up to date on all of my content. If you guys are new, hi, hello, my name is Chris. I'm a mom, a wife, a worker bee, and we are out here working and twerking so we can become debt free. Yes, you guys, I did get my nails done, okay? We are out here. It's a little early for Valentine's, but you know, I couldn't help myself and I did go ahead and get my nails done I don't know if you guys can let me see if I can hmm am I focus a little nail cam okay so you know they're not um, I don't hate them I don't love them they're okay they're like a 7 out of 10 for me okay here's my little thumbs some squiggly vibes going on but it's just not like it's just not giving what it was supposed to give, okay? And then on top of that, she nicked me twice, both on my pinky right over here. So I was bleeding in both my pinkies and they put liquid band-aids on me. You guys, it was a whole thing, a whole thing. But if you haven't, be sure to watch my reel. I did a little Saturday, um, spend a Saturday with me reel on my Instagram. And I think it's probably gonna be on a YouTube short probably too. So check that out um, to see how much I spent that day and if I I was crying that night as well um but this year you guys i know it's like almost february it's probably gonna be february by the time you guys see this video i'm so behind so late but you guys knew that because you know i'm just that girl so i wanted to share with you guys my 2023 goals and i am gonna write them down for us because you know when you write something down you manifest it you you have more accountability over it so i am using my hello kitty stationary paper from lissandra and i had a huge haul so i will have that um linked in my bio um or in this video description so i'm gonna put my goals on this side and then at the end of the year hopefully i can check them off i mean i don't know i don't know what i'm doing here but you know it is what it is so i just want to be able to look at them at the end of the year and see what we did if we surpassed it if we didn't um and what we can do to improve i'm all about improving okay i'm all about being just you know progressing forward improving there's always room for improvement you guys so let's see these 2023 goals and let me grab let me see if I can can you guys see that I don't know if I can zoom in but maybe my my hubby my editor-in-chief can zoom in so um if you guys are new to my channel because i do have a few new subscribers and i wanted to say thank you for tuning in and joining me on my little corner of the interwebs um on my debt-free journey you guys uh, my hubby and i actually we budget together and separately all at the same time um it's just kind of the way how we live it works for us and it's been working great for us he also does all the editing for my videos and everything like that the music the stuff the things you know um so all of that he does start to finish he uploads everything he just does everything all of it i'm just the hands okay i'm just the hands um so yeah that's where we're at and honestly i don't have too many goals for 2023 but let me see i wonder how to zoom in hold on hold on Okay, well, never mind. I do not think I can zoom in. Forget it. Um, but I wanted to share with you guys my goals anyway. So there's not a lot. Very simple. So my first one is just to be, save $2,000 for the wedding that we're going to be in this year. So I'm going to put number one, 2 k for a wedding. And I'm writing with a marker in hopes that you guys can see this. And I... I'm not even sure if 2000 is going to cover the, the expenses for the wedding because, again, I'm not sure how much everything is going to be as of yet. We're still waiting on final numbers for the groomsmen stuff. Um, so once we get the groomsmen stuff in, we'll know how much everything's, you know, going to be, you know, I just... I. 
I don't know. Um, so that's what we're waiting for. As of right now, I know for a fact that uh, my dress is going to be around 100. Um, alterations, I'm probably going to need those. Those last... What year was that? Well, I don't know. Everything is expensive. So my dress is probably going to be under 200, like 100 to 200 maybe with alterations. Um, it just depends. So I'm not sure. That's why I'm kind of like buffering it in, you know, hair and makeup is probably going to be around 200 most likely. And then of course, nails, that's going to be around 100 to 200 and it's just a lot shoes i gotta figure out shoe you guys i don't even know is 2000 enough see i have to see what's gonna what's happening there um so as soon as i figure out more stuff but as of right now i'm gonna keep it at 2000 because y'all already know um i can always save money in all kinds of places as far as like my nails and stuff like that and alterations it just it just depends on the alterations if it's something as simple as having the bottom um my mom can do that so that is for a free 99 which you all already know if it's free it's for me okay so yeah i'm just gonna leave that at 2k for now the second one is just gonna be super simple this is more of a personal goal and not a budgeting goal um and this is to read more books so at the end of last year i picked up more books than i normally would have um i shared a little bit on my channel i did my book review of kamiko love's book um the budget mom i will have that linked right over here i did another book um the atomic habits i'll, I'll have that linked right over here as well so i did a few books that i shared that were more relevant to my channel but these are the kind of books that uh i i read on my spare time on my lunch at work um right before i go to bed so far i have read um two colleen hoover books and or was that last year you know what i'm gonna have to check the dates on that but so far i've got well no i don't know i think i'm on okay so i'm reading slammed right now by coho and then i have the two books the two other books in the series for that series from coho and then i want to move on to um there's another series that i want to read by coho and then i have a few other books in my cart that you know i'm just everywhere with the books and yeah I'm just everywhere. So I'm excited though. I want to read at least one book a month and that would be 12 books for the year at the minimum. I want to read more than that because the books in my cart, I have like 26. Uh, do I have $26 worth of book money? No, but you know, hey, you never know. I could use my, you know, fetch reward points to, to get a gift card or maybe there might be a sale so i'm just everywhere you guys just everywhere so that's one of my goals and then thirdly and also last is something that i want for all of us and that is i want to earn more money and that is just that uh I am still working at my current job. I don't know if you guys can even see this. I'm still working at my current job and I just want to earn more, whether that is at my current job, at someone else's current job, here on you know, social media, um, on my Etsy shop, just anywhere and everywhere that God will allow it. I'm here to receive his abundance, you guys. So that's what I have, you know, that's what I have going on. Like I know it's pretty straightforward. Um, it's not a long list, you guys. It's just, you know, we're just focusing on things at home, one thing at a time. Arya is switching schools mid-year. Uh, so that's, you know, eating a lot eating up some of our budget as well we just have some things that we need to prioritize and one of those is our you know the wedding that we have this year and then we also have another wedding next year and hopefully we'll have a wedding after that um so hey you never know uh so that's where i'm at you guys if you guys have any questions or you know anything like that please leave a comment down below and if you have made it to this part of the video thank you so much for staying let me grab something real quick so i can share with you guys 
Okay, so speaking of goals, I know everyone is starting fresh this year. You know, it's January, we like to start fresh, we like to do a reset. While we're on that topic, I did want to go ahead and redo this giveaway. I did this giveaway a while back and it didn't work out for the winner because um, they were out of the country. So if you would like to enter this giveaway, um, I will have the giveaway rules down below you have to be living in the united states with a united states address it doesn't matter if you're like a canadian living in the united states or something like that um, as long as you are currently living in the united states with a current united states shipping address home address business address um you can enter this video 18 and up only let me know if you guys have any questions down below or you can dm me on instagram at chris budgets if you have any questions but you guys have seen this before and i'm excited to share them again um and hopefully they can have a nice home and these are super cute and right in time for valentine's day you guys so this is a cute little binder right over here and i'm just gonna do a quick little thing over here so you guys can see the inside and there's a lot of stuff that comes with this you guys so um so this is the first bundle so this will be for the this will be the first prize and these are some super adorable dashboards if you guys are into pink which you already know that i am um these are some adorable dashboards i love these these are super cute especially with the springtime coming up you know it's giving warm weather vibes um i don't know where you guys live I live over here in coastal Virginia. I have my P.O. box in the description below if you guys are interested in ever sending me some happy mail or a love letter, okay? Um, no pressure, but I always have that link down below. And then these are some envelopes that also come with this. And let me see here. I do not know which shops these are all from, by the way, you guys. Um, these were sent to me from a subscriber that wanted to share the wealth. Um, so we have bills, beauty, shopping, vacation, savings, miscellaneous, loans, groceries, date night, Christmas, car maintenance, birthdays and that is it um so this is the first prize you guys i wanted to share that with you if you are looking for a more in-depth uh video i will link um somewhere the other video that i had posted the other the previous original giveaway video but i just wanted to say thank you to lily um she is actually the one who sent these over to me and she sent a bunch of stuff actually um so i'm just gonna wrap this back up and I put this to the side over here. And then our second bundle is right over here. And this is a super cute rose gold binder. I love rose gold. My uh, wedding band is actually rose gold and my I don't know what this is called, but like the stuff that holds the diamond in or whatever is rose gold. I love that. I love that for me, okay? So I love rose gold and I hope one of you guys out there does too. Uh, so this is what the inside of the binder looks like. I wish you guys can kind of, I don't know, can you see that it's like more like a metallic rose gold? It's like a touch of metallic. So it's super cute. Love this. And this one comes with a lot of stuff over here. We have this pouch. You can do um cash in here coupons receipts really a catch-all you can keep this in your purse you can make it into a wallet you can even put your cash dividers in here and then in here we have i want to say these are dashboards oh no these are actually these go into your planner these are planner inserts so if you are a planner girl um this would be really cute and what i mean is if you're not a planner girl and you don't know um these go into here and they kind of peekaboo right over here super cute super aesthetic you know if you're that girl so this is cute i love this oh hello hello Okay, first of all, I don't know. Um, Siri was talking to me. Um, 
I actually have Siri turned off on my phone. I had no idea she can talk on my watch. Uh, I just got my watch like this last year. So yeah, I don't know anything about that. I barely, I just wear my watch. I actually don't do stuff, so. And then these are super cute. I love these because you can put a lot of cash in here if you need to, if you want to make this into a sinking fund binder. So there's some stickers right over here. And then these you can customize. You get if you have a Cricut or even if you don't have a Cricut, you can just write on a Sharpie with this. That's what I used to do. Or I used to put like index cards and write what I needed. Um, so this is super great for a beginner budgeter. If you're just starting out, or if you want to do sinking funds and stuff like that. Um, yeah, there's uh, one, two, three, uh, four, five, six, seven, seven of these. And I just, this is actually like the kind that I use for my sinking fund binder. So that's why I say I love it because, you know, it holds a lot of cash, you know, especially if you're saving long term. Um, so if you guys are interested in this giveaway, either in prize one or two, I will be picking two winners. And um, just all you have to do to enter is drop a hashtag, okay? It's not hard. So just do um, hashtag Chris Hearts, okay? And that's hashtag K R I S H E A R T S. And that's it. Hashtag Chris Hart. Super easy, super simple, right in time for Valentine's Day. Um, if you guys are new to budgeting, um, you know, please enter. Or if you know anybody that you think might like these prizes and would utilize these and enjoy these, you know, please tag them down below. Send them this video. Um, and wish you guys luck. I will be, well, hold on because actually I don't even know what day it is because I'm so late. Okay, so today is actually um, Sunday the 29th. So, oh, now it's Sunday the 29th. Okay, well, it's Sunday the 29th. So I will go ahead and announce this winner uh, um, Wednesday, February 1st, one, two, three. No, is that enough time? Three days? Okay, I will announce the winner Friday, February 3rd. Sorry, I'm looking at my calendar. February 3rd, I will announce the winner on my Instagram. I might do it on my shorts on YouTube probably. Uh, and that's it, you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in to my extra long-winded video. As per usual, I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Yeah.